Uh, I'm starting to think that this game is just making fun of me. This game, this mod, whatever you want to call it, I think I think it's having a good old time, right of a time, messing with me. Because as you know, yesterday I tamed that up. I was actually spent like five minutes looking for where my Tyranodon disappeared to. Well, he's up there in the sky, nice and safe from me getting it killed like I do all of my tames um but as you know I was looking to tame this or craft this thing a saddle yesterday and we couldn't find any dinosaurs to do it there's a few trilobites around for a bit of chitin but uh I still needed more chitin well the game has just delivered me an insect this 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 dragonfly over here but do you want to know the ir irony of it do you want to know the, the the crazy part about it do you want to know the this is where the game's really starting to it's a tech it's a tech meganura a tech insect where is this where the tech dragonflies exist well, anyways, uh, I'm pretty sure that if I actually manage to hit a target, which isn't my strong suit, I'm pretty sure that if I do, in fact, get a kill on this thing, uh, if I can get a kill on this thing, <laughs> why, why are you, why are you healing up and stuff? Can you just die, please? I just need to hit you with one, one last spear, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to give me what I need, which is, of course, chitin. Uh, but I'm still going to try. I'm still going to try. Yeah, I didn't think so. Oil, electronics, element scrap, element dust, sorry, and scrap metal. And as, well, it's a phoenix dinosaur, which means it decided to respawn itself. In case you didn't know what a phoenix does, it rises from the flames, rises from its ashes, and is reborn once again. But guys, welcome. Welcome back to our Omega series. Uh, I've actually been a little busy since yesterday. I tamed a turtle. A brutal turtle. This guy right over here. Now, in case you don't know what brutal dinosaurs do... Uh, that makes two of us, but I'm pretty sure they're strong. I'm pretty sure they deal extra damage. And unfortunately, in this turtle's um, regard, he's, he's actually really slow. So he's kind of a very inefficient killer. But I was hoping to tame a dinosaur that can do some damage. And I actually don't know if I've succeeded at that. Um, once I get myself a turtle saddle, which I maybe can do. I don't have cementing. I, again, I need more chitin. Ah, but once I can do that, we will be able to find out. Oh, I got a little dodo here as well. This little yellow dude right here. Um, who? I'm just trying to... I need to throw him somewhere that I can actually see his eggs. Because if he's sleeping on my bed, I'm not going to be able to see if he lays any eggs. Which we obviously need for kibble for more taming. So, yeah, we're in a little bit of a... No, I wouldn't say a situation, but we're going around in circles a little bit. We're slowly getting there. Um, we're collecting a bunch of souls and essences, which is great because I'm going to turn them into some arrows and be able to knock some stronger dinosaurs out. Um, I don't know if I care about the obsidian triceratops anymore. What we need right this second, more than anything, is um, chitin. I need chitin so I can get a saddle, much around it on, or for whatever I want to use it on, and then we can keep moving from there. Also, hi, obsidian poop. Oh, maybe I'll just get my obsidian that way. I can't even remember why I need obsidian at this point, but I know that we do need it for something. Um, so if you could just do a few more obsidian poops for me, mate, that would be absolutely fantastic. Um, but yeah, I've been kind of working my way around just killing things that I can kill. Um, like this compi, maybe. Please don't hurt me. In case you're wondering what a gorgon does. I'm pretty sure it turns me to stone. So we got to avoid these little dudes, of course, as well. Um, we still got our ridiculously fast boots on, by the way, which let me run at like two times speed, which is absolutely amazing. <gasps> a knockback Lystrosaurus. Easy kill. And it's going to get me a rage, a rage, a rage thing, soul, whatever you want to call the thing. So bam, get wrecked, you. Uh, what else have we got around here? We got a prime metal trilobite. Unfortunately, this thing's going to have insane damage reduction, but... Actually, will you give me chitin? I don't think you would. Got some dodos over there as well, but they're just regular dodos. Um, it's worth a shot. Yeah, 45 damage. No, thank you very much. We're going to be here for years trying to kill that thing there. An absorbent dodo. Hello. Um, I, oh, wow. You have a lot of health. You're not going to fight me back, are you? I actually died uh, <laughs> between last episode and today um, because... What, what was it again? Something killed me. I attacked something. A trilobite. I attacked a trilobite that shot a fireball at me and killed me. Yeah, I died to a trilobite. So add one to the death counter because I'm a dummy, I guess. We all know that, though. That's no surprise to anybody. Um, it just is what it is. An alpha fairy Lystrosaurus. Very tempting to kill, but I'm just going to keep on moving on. Beta Earth Lystrosaurus. No, thank you very much. You probably end up killing me. A Phoenix Triceratops. Could probably tame it, but I feel like I'll just end up ruining it. 
and this guy over here a spectral tech parasaur um he's gonna go invisible that's fine but hopefully i can hit you with these despite you being very very evasive somehow come on one more needs to the hit there we go and we should be able to get us a nice little bunch of resources for that nice all right not doing too bad we're not doing too bad basically the name of the game for us right this second is to collect as many of these souls and essences as we possibly can and the more that we get the uh the more we're going to be able to do that's really the gist of it we'll be able to craft better items oh no i bowled you and i bowled i need to bowl this little dude as well i do need to be careful here i'm gonna kill you first sorry oh uh hold on hold on hold on a second this stegosaurus got involved summoned in minions and got me killed <laughs> well we've got our first death of the episode out the way i suppose now it's time for us to knuckle down and not die for the rest of the day which we all know is borderline impossible but hey at least we keep our loot and i got these speedy boots that i hope we get back there in seconds what are you you're yours i think this is a zombie i've still got my spyglass it's a prime zombie pteranodon so who survives the chaos over here also who upset the stegosaurus that was a really bad idea also i don't get the loot out of any of those two kills now because i wasn't here to obtain it when they died was i because the stego did it while i was dead that really sucks that really really hurts well look maybe trilobite a wood trilobite oh do i have the patience for this is the question we'll say a beta random dota all right i'm gonna try oh but you're gonna do explodey poop again oh i just need a way of dealing damage man maybe i just stomach this one out in saying that i don't actually know if this guy's gonna give me chitin or if he's just gonna give me wood when i kill him either way so he's gonna give me resource kibble and i do need resource souls to craft up better harvesting tools so i think i'm just gonna go for it and keep my distance because this little explosions are kind of hurting me and we're just gonna deal 50 damage at a time until he eventually has no health left oh my goodness yep the omega mod it's a tough one it's a tough difficulty curb curve rather to climb but once you do manage to get past the early game stages it's pretty free flowing from there we're slowly making ground we're slowly making progress and that's really what matters overall here we go three more hits and one more see you later you're not gonna go poop on me anymore are you you're totally gonna give me wood when i harvest you as well aren't you thatch and sap as well interesting um i guess i may as well get sap out of you i was really hoping for ah i was really hoping for some chitin though we really just need chitin at this point i guess it's not meant to be any other trilobites around but perhaps of oh that overwrapped is actually kind of dangerous so i'm gonna avoid that dude a lot of these dinosaurs have crazy abilities which is why i'm ignoring a lot of them um but really i just need a there's something going on on up there i just need a trilobite or an ant or a dragonfly without any special buffs or abilities or anything like that or even a turtle beta psychosis yeah these guys will both kill me there's a comet tech triceratops honestly that would be an amazing tame i think i'm pretty sure it shoots comets which would be amazing but i don't have any kibble to tame one so that's kind of disappointing um all right let's bring everything that we've collected back to base i feel like that's our best bet right this second we'll see if we can craft anything special up we can also see what sort of kibble we can craft and we can work from there in saying that hello i'm so glad i came back in this direction because you are exactly what i need right this second trilobite you are in the wrong place at the wrong time my friend but kind of the right place at the right time because you just might be able to give me that little bit of chitin that i need to finally get my saddles let's find out i need 75 we've got 75 all right we've got our saddle and we've got we got we got semantic paste we got everything okay that's good that's really good also another one over here hi how you doing this is a taming trilobite i don't recall what that means i think it knocks it 
it helps with taming, I guess. I don't really know. Um, but whatever. Let's go and get some more chitin. And we'll never need chitin ever again. We all know that's not true, but at least now that's sorted. Another... Okay, another one of these guys. I mean, I'm going to kill you. It's a tech dinosaur at the end of the day. Uh, it is a phoenix dinosaur, though, which means it basically heals up when you kill it. Uh, so you got to kill phoenix dinosaurs twice, basically. All right, get wrecked. Access inventory? No, we're going to harvest you, I'm afraid, buddy. And I'm going to break my tool. Okay, that's really disappointing. Um, and you just respawned fine that's okay <laughs> wait it's now it's just a regular tech oh no it's still a phoenix tech never mind it's all good all right let's get this thing going let's do this thing at last all right my dodo is apparently underneath my thing that's fine let's get the turretted unsettled at last and on top of all that uh let's see what sort of souls we now have i think that's everything um let's sort through this so we've got three guardian souls we've got four nightmare souls two utility a resource so it's a bit of a collection of randoms um and i guess this is where we now need to kind of look into what we can do with these uh oh saddle armor raft armor oh yes please okay that can help keep my raft alive i guess um cool other I don't think I need any of that just yet. Potions? Health potions, maybe? Again, we don't really need that right this second. There's some saddles, sedatives, structures. Oh, yes, I do need one of these. I need, and I might be able to get it now, an egg collector, but I need 10 cementing paste. Okay, that's fine. The reason we need this, in case you're wondering, is I'm actually going to craft up 20 of these. The reason we need cementing paste, or rather the egg collector, is it collects the eggs and apparently it makes your dinosaurs lay eggs a lot faster and quicker so yeah that's uh that's definitely a must i'm gonna have to find some room on this raft to place it somewhere i don't, I don't quite know where it's gonna be but uh yeah as you can see the egg collector can integrate female dinosaurs into it uh the dino oh the dino will be destroyed but the dino's egg type will be stored in the egg collector well it's gonna get destroyed eventually one day whether it's out here or not so <laughs> What I'm saying is I'm going to get this thing killed. Um, can I need to be placed near your base? What? Okay, that's interesting. Does that mean I need a foundation? Is that what constitutes as a base? I really should have placed foundations on this. I really just got to rip this this raft up in a, like soon. But uh, for now, let's just, let's just place that there. That's not on the raft, is it? I think one of my settings is wrong. I can't place that. Yeah, look, I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm leaving it behind. Ah, uh, yep, this is the thing. I'm pretty sure this is one of my S plus settings that's a little bit broken. Uh, but regardless, uh, I can still place the egg collect. This isn't working, is it? Is this a bad idea? This is probably a bad idea. If I go and oh, it's got an egg in it already. Uh, choose nearby females to integrate. So if I integrate my dodo, my, my dodo's still here. Okay. Integrate females. Am I meant, am I wanting to do that? I actually don't know. Does that mean now we've, we've trapped our dodo inside of this thing? I think we have. I don't really know. I'm confused. If I read the description, it would probably explain it to me. Um, but anyways, we'll come back to this soon and we'll see if it's got an egg inside of it, I suppose. <laughs> uh, for now though, we've got our little armor let's throw it on our raft there you go and on top of that it's time for me to get my pteranodon down from up in the sky so this guy here's a little bit this guy's here's a little bit damaged hold on real quick maybe i should just tame this but i don't think i can do that just yet so instead i'm gonna throw some spears at its head which is gonna have some pretty good damage uh my pteranodon i hope i don't accidentally hurt you in the process we're good. All right. All right, my friend. Take this saddle. And let's uh, let's take flight. Let's do this. <laughs> We're up in the sky at last. I don't really know what to do with my levels right this second. So, is it like, this isn't a crazy good pteranodon or anything like that. But it's at least... Oh, it's a pteranodon. Uh, let's see what it can do. All right, it's more damage than most of my weapons. Um, can I pick this up? I don't even know if you can pick moss chopsters up. 
Come here, buddy. Oh. That's my ability. I don't know what my ability is. Maybe I can absorb health or something? Interesting. Can I pick this thing up? Oh, I can. Would I be really dumb to attack this? That's what I'm kind of nervous about right now. But if I do... Oh, I can't attack it from, from holding it. Okay, that's probably a good thing. Because it probably just end up killing me. Um, although I do kind of want to... Do I want to kill you or do I want to... No, I don't want to tame it. What, what's taming it going to achieve? That's not really going to achieve much, is it? This guy, on the other hand... You I am going to kill. You are going to... He's going to teleport away. I... I really... I'm like the most inaccurate spear thrower. Oh my goodness. It's it's like a... It, there, there is no drop off when you throw this thing. And I still can't hit a target. Oh my goodness. It's a dodo. It's like the slowest creature in the game. My goodness. That was embarrassing. <laughs> but we did get a quest scroll. I have no idea what this is. Uh, quest type. Chest quest. Loot. Chest quest. Re uh, requirements. Unlock 100 loot chests. Reward 5 max experience. Dude! Consume it? I'm assuming it shows up here somewhere. Quests. Unlock loot chests. I have to unlock 100 loot chests. That's my quest. That is an insane quest. Considering I don't think we've ever found one. We definitely haven't opened one. But I don't also think I've ever found one. So that's actually that's actually quite crazy. Um, Good to know though. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> now, real quick, I did want to just check. And unfortunately, this, uh, this foundation I placed. Very silly idea. Don't we don't have any more eggs here yet. You integrated egg layers. Choose nearby females to integrate. I'm pretty sure I did integrate my my dodo into here, but there's no eggs. Unless unless that's what this egg is. No, it's just a regular dodo egg. I might have killed my dodo for nothing. I'm not too sure just yet. Um, but I did want to see what do we need for beta kibble. I think we're going to need basic eggs we need ethereal oh okay so you can't tame up a beta dinosaur until you have eggs from like a a, a regular dinosaur so we're not quite able to do that just yet fair enough fair enough um we do have eight levels up our sleeve though so let's go and get some weight and then more damage since most of our damage is still coming from melee shots um, and then let's have a look down here and see what we can get. We can now get prime arrows. Lovely. That's really good. I can actually knock some dinosaurs out. Grappling hooks. What else have we got? That's about it, really. Ultimate health potions? We're nowhere near ready for that, but good to, good to see it anyways. Um, I don't think anything else is really relevant right this second. But I do want to have a quick check in here because now that we've got all of these souls, how far are we from getting some of these extra weapons that we need? Um, because it was recommended... Ooh. An un ooh, a boomstick. A club capable of area explosions. All right, we, we can't get that just yet. The multi-tool is kind of at the top of my list, but we need two more resource souls and five obsidian, which I have. Hey, my obsidian poop. It's going to pay off, maybe. We'll see. Um, I also... This was the ghost of an infamous deadly hatchet. Curses enemies on attack. Makes them take more damage. I can craft that. Okay, that actually is going to be handy. Especially if I'm going looking for resource dinosaurs. Then there's the icicle. An old sickle infused with the powers of nature. Uh, the icicle deals ice damage. Cool. The warp bow. I don't have any cosmic souls. The chromatic boomerang. I've already got one. Gateway orb. Doesn't sound like something I need. But the net gun does sound really cool. And to get that, I need one utility soul. I don't have a utility soul. Well, I got two. I need one more. Then there's the Hades Torch, which is actually one of the recommended items. Um, greatly increases light radius, damage, and is unbreakable. So I guess I'll grab one of those. And the other stuff I can't get just yet. So we got our hands on some useful tools. That's really that's really good. I don't know what these do yet. Like, I, I, I kind of want to see them in action before I get too excited. So let's go and see them in action. Uh, this can only be equipped at night. Wait, what? This? The Phantom? The Goat? Curses. No! I don't like to play at night. So I can't use that at night time. <laughs> That's really disappointing. Sorry, I can't use it at daytime, only night time. That actually that's actually really painful. Um oh man. Okay, I guess I gotta wait for night time then, I guess. Dang. That's oh snap. Sorry, I just saw something. 
Turtle's angry. It's the uncontrollable turtle. He's coming back. Don't. Hold on. I need my tames. Guys, guys, come with me. Come with me. Come with me. Uh, yeah, she doesn't seem like he wants my turtle. So I'm just going to grab my Tyranodon. And we're good. We're good. Um, yes. These guys are angry. Very, very angry. Which I kind of went over that yesterday. Um, but let's just have a look at these guys. Let's see what we can do here. The turtle's still coming for me. But I found a few guys that we might be able to actually... Die. I'm out of here. Okay. How, how angry are these little dudes? Oh, yes. Oh, hold on. Don't, don't kill them at all. <laughs> I didn't expect... I didn't expect his minions to go and attack some wild dinosaurs. That's actually kind of funny. Um, that was the... What, what did they even attack? Oviraptor, I'm pretty sure. All right, you. I still want to kill you. Now that the turtles, like, left us alone as well. We've got a familiar Oviraptor. Little banana. Summoning his little minions to do his dirty work for him. I'm a little nervous about this turtle to my left as well. All right. Uh, be careful, Tyranodon, please. If you attack that turtle, we're, we're dead. We're all dead. Everything's dead. We're going to lose it all. So don't do that. Whatever you do. All right, get Rex. Nice. All right, let's, let's move. Let's go see what we can find. So I need a utility dinosaur, uh, which basically, if you're wondering what I'm looking at to find that, I'm looking at the kibble that it needs. So on the side of the screen there, as you can see, uh, it says guardian kibble. That basically means when I kill it, it's going to give me a guardian soul. This one's going to give me a summoner soul. Uh, this is going to give me a mythical soul. We're looking for something that is a utility dinosaur. That Comet Triceratops is actually really... I'm actually considering it. I just need Cosmic Kibble. So I need to kill two Cosmic Dinosaurs to get a Cosmic Triceratops. So let's have a little look around. We can see what we can find. If we can find some very... That's a Wyvern. Spiritual Dodo Wyvern. Oh, gosh. Um, uh, yeah, watch. Let's, 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 just, let's just see what we can find. Maybe some of these Dodos. Nope. They're all just ordinary Dodos. There's a Psychosis fish down there uh self-destructive listrosaurus oh hello that actually might be helpful it's also a, 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 a siren water jug bug all right so this is actually i need to be careful here this will obviously explode i don't know how big the explosion is going to be but i surely not this big i don't actually don't also know if i don't know like at what point it decides to explode so i'm just gonna Get it from a distance. No, 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 no. What are you doing? Are you... Uh, dude, run, 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 run. Oh, wait, 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 wait. He's literally on fire right this second. He's literally on fire. Does he self-destruct on death or what's his story? All right, I got to tell my dinosaurs to just chill. Come on, I want this unstable. I want this unstable soul so I can craft the boomstick. It's looking smoky. I can't see him. I'm going to totally die here, aren't I? Are you going to explode? <laughs> I'm so nervous. Eee! Oh, yes. I feel like I just blew up a, uh, like a dynamite or something. There's a raptor. Okay. All right. Did I at least get the soul from it? I didn't. I wasn't even paying attention. We did. Um, and at some point there, I also looked. I looked at a breeding Lystrosaurus. I don't know where it went, but... I, I looked at something. There he is. That guy right there. This here is our utility dinosaur that we were looking for. Sorry, my dude. You are in the wrong place at the wrong time, but thank you very much. I think... I didn't even... I can't even remember what we needed the utility soul for, but we now have ourselves the utility soul that we were looking for. Let's also this random dialo down here. And there was a wind raptor. I don't know where he's gotten to. Maybe I should go looking. Oh, guess what? Go, go, go. I don't know what these guys are. Oh. 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 No. Leave me alone, please. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. A pearl. Okay. No, thank you. There's also... Uh, no. No. That's a... Uh, that's a real Dodo Wyvern. It wasn't just a Wyvern. There was a Dodo Wyvern down here. Um, we are in so much trouble. I don't know how strong it is, but it's it's really fast. 
and from memory the spiritual trait means that they are ridiculously fast i'm pretty sure that's what spiritual means as far as this mod goes um i don't know what to do i don't know what to do i don't know what to do i'm gonna try and get stuck here somewhere this is terrible this is really bad this is really bad is he do, do we lose it is he has he lost is he oh, no he's too right on us <laughs> go away <laughs> please go away please go away uh i have no idea how i'm gonna lose this thing i think i might have lost him i think i might have lost him he is so quick Oh my goodness, it reminds me of the ice dragon or the zombie dragon from uh, Game of Thrones. Not that that's really a relevant comparison anymore, but you get what I'm talking about if you've seen the show. Oh my gosh. Well, that area of the beach is now out of effect. We can't go down that way anymore. Okay, lovely. Fantastic even. That was something, wasn't it? Um, I don't feel safe. <laughs> I don't feel safe at all but um we're home we're home that's good okay so what do we even need this utility soul for it was one of the weapons or was it the multi no that was the resource one um it was the net the net gun but i need gunpowder still okay turtles you guys are terrifying me right now i'm really not into it um how much okay i've got charcoal and then we need i can't remember spark powder we need spark powder so let's get some of that I only need like three of those and then wait one more i think it was three and then we can craft a net gun sweet a small net launching gun used to ensnare targets for an extended period does not require ammo and cannot be broken can trap enemies 50 percent larger than a bowler and is much easier to use so the bowler is officially retired which means i wonder if should I just test it on the first dinosaur that I see? Should we just... Let's go. Why not? Wait, what? Okay. Okay, so I can't take down big dinosaurs. I was silly to assume that it would. Um, so unfortunately... We're going... We're going... Well... Oh, no. <gasps> Wait, my turtle's going to help me. Yes. Help me out, guys. Show me what you're made of. Oh, the brutal turtle hits. Um, we should really... Wait, what? Is he dead? Oh, no, he got frozen. Oh, my goodness. I had a heart attack. Oh, did he die? No, he didn't die. He just got frozen because it's a Gorgon carb uh, Carbo. I was going to make sure this guy here doesn't see what we're doing to his buddy. Um, but otherwise, I think we're okay. A little bit terrifying, but I think we're fine. Uh, random super turkey. That doesn't sound good. Uh, yeah, he's angry. Turtle's angry. Come on, get the job done here, guys. Let's go. go. No, nope, he's cool. He doesn't care. Never mind. Yeah, you guys take your time. Make him suffer. It's fine. It's all okay. <laughs> and the job is done. Uh, I just... Wait. Oh, now we got the stinking tech thing. Dragonflies decided to join the fight. Oh, I can... Guys, no, no, no. Stop, 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 stop. Come here, please. Come here. Come here. Come here. No, no, no. That's not... Let's just stay away from the turtle, please. Stay away from the turtle. This guy, I should be able to shoot with a net if I can actually hit a target, which we've established not very good at. Okay, everybody just sit still. I'm going to end up netting my own dinosaur. Yep. Oh, <laughs> glad you got it. <laughs> get wrecked. Okay, take that. Hey, you like them apples, mate? That's what you get. That's what you get. That's what you get. Fantastic. Keep forgetting I can't equip this hatchet that I think I can equip and I keep trying for some silly reason but it just can't happen it whatever it is what it is fantastic all right let's drop all this stuff here off I guess I'm gonna just leave the hatchet in there because I can't use it unless it's nighttime which is really disappointing but not much we can really do about that but we do have this I forgot about this we've got this torch um it greatly increases damage and is unbreakable Ooh. Have a look at that. Um, I don't know what I'm meant to do with it, but do I just hold it? Oh, what can I hit with it? This dodo, great. I mean, that was decent. But am I like, what am I meant to do with it? Hold on. Am I meant to put it in my offhand slot maybe? No, that's not how it works. I thought maybe I could like have it in my other hand. You know what I mean? It does say it greatly increases damage. 
unless it means like while riding a team like if i ride my tyranidon and then i've got it all right now i need to test this out i reckon this is what it means i reckon it means my tyranidon will now deal extra damage i don't think so i might have been wrong yeah it's about the same <laughs> it's, it's about the same uh no don't pick him up what are we picking him up for yep oh wait no 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 it went from 60 to 90. Oh, it does do we're doing like 50 percent more damage yo that's actually decent this is a metal trailer but it's a waste of time i'm not gonna bother hitting it any further um okay this is actually rather interesting this is gonna be a bad idea oh okay that wasn't very kind that wasn't very nice that wasn't very nice buddy cut that out will you that's not nice at all not at all okay well the torch is cool once i learn to hit for more damage i'm sure it'll come in really really handy but for now uh we're pretty limited with how much damage we can do i'm not the strongest dude in the world we will get there guys i'm gonna end this one right here though thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy it please go ahead punch that thumbs up but most importantly have a fantastic day and i'll catch you tomorrow bye for now